And that trend will continue. Next up for Milwaukee at the Lakers, Friday night on ESPN. In the East, a loss would put them in a tie in the loss column with Philadelphia. Sung their way off in that shot. Giannis might be done for the night with uh, this huge lead. Got Frank Mason on the floor. See, and that's what I'm saying. Like, they're, they're, this team is so focused, right? They've been so good all year that you really don't have to sit your players in low management because when you play the right way, you end up blowing a lot of teams out. So your guys usually have to sit in the fourth quarter. Here's Holiday driving. Sumner's going to try again. This one was off to the right. Indiana's missed 13 consecutive threes. They're 6 of 25 in the night. Bonasis at Dedekumbo's kind of come into the game with the next dead ball. Giannis is brushed out of fourth, but just like it seems hard for New Orleans to make up that kind of ground to catch Memphis, it's hard to imagine a team in seventh going all the way to the fourth spot, picking up four games and jumping three teams as Bonasis is about a field goal. Sterling Brown, 30-year pro out of SMU. Nice hand and score. Play for my coach, Larry Brown at SMU. Not let you let up late in the season when you really don't need wins. You're out for number one seed, but it's something that just keep you engaged. Mason throws it away. Lopez. And he goes, well, I hope so. They're my friends and family. This guy was a great line. <laughs> Got a fun personality. He's really enjoying every moment of what he's done so far in the league. Adetokounmpo got the rebound out to Mason. Here's the other Adetokounmpo again, missing the three. Sterling Brown's going to try it. So bottom of the hour, New Orleans and Dallas up next here on ESPN. Next time we'll see the Bucks will be at the Lakers on Friday in a matchup of the top two teams.